Attorney General, is it appropriate for the state to impose penalties on cities, on local government, for not going along with federal law? I mean, we've had a push-pull with the feds for years over seat belts, over um, speed limits, all kinds of things that we have waited to go ahead and implement the law until we risk losing money. Is it appropriate for the state to do this considering the push-pull we always have with them? I, I think it is absolutely appropriate because, and, and, and here's the reasoning why. There's no excuse for breaking the law. This is a matter of law. It is against the law to knowingly, willfully, and not cooperate with the federal government when a person is in this country illegally. That is a matter of federal law. When our duly elected officials who uphold, who swear to uphold the laws of this country and the Constitution embark upon policies that contradict the very oath that they have sworn to uphold, it is absolutely necessary for the legislature to then impose an enforcement mechanism on them. Because if not, then why should we why should we enforce the penalty when someone breaks into your house? They might be poor, it might need whatever they take out of your house. 